OK, well, I'm delighted to say, joining us now, live from Selhurst Park, Harry Kane, live here on our Premier League coverage on NBC. Harry, it's lovely to have you with us. Thank you so much for joining us. Congratulations on the victory and the two goals for yourself as well. My first question has to be, what was said at half-time that made such a quick difference second half? Yeah, well, I think... Um, I thought we started the game well, the first kind of 10, 15 minutes. We switched the play, we pressed well. Uh, we just let that uh, kind of clinical edge in the in the final third. And then uh, Paddis had a spell in the game towards the second half of the first half, and uh, we kind of done well to, to not concede. And then second half, we just said to get back to to how we started, you know, switching the play, uh, getting the full-backs high, uh, and then just being more creative in the final third. And uh, thankfully, uh, we was able to do that. And two quick goals at a, a really important stage in the game uh, and then finished it off nicely. Hi, Harry. Tim Howard here. Uh, brilliant job. Congratulations on your brace today. Uh, a lot's been Thank made you. of of Tottenham conceding first uh, way too often this season. That wasn't the case today. Is that something that the players are conscious of? Is that something the manager has to drill into you to, to kind of wake up and do things quicker in, in, when the game kicks off? How does that work? Yeah, no, for sure. It's something we spoke about. I think it was nine or ten games in a row that we'd conceded first, which uh, just isn't good enough at, at this level. So uh, it was just about working hard, uh, doing more on the training pitch, trying to figure out uh, a way of being more compact, but still having that attacking edge. And, um, yeah, we were able to do that tonight. Hugo pulled off some good saves at, at uh, important moments, and, and that definitely helped as well. So uh, it's, a, it's a good confidence boost for, for everyone today with a clean sheet the four goals, and uh, we've got a tough spell coming up in the league, so hopefully we can use this as some momentum uh, for the rest of the month. Hi, Harry. Danny Higginbotham, congratulations on the win. Great second-half performance in particular. In, what, was it so important in the second half that you got the team higher up the pitch, that the wing-backs got forward? Because then it seemed to me as though yourself and the other forwards were able to play closer together. Yeah, I think with the with the system we play, uh, the wing-backs are so important for us to, to be an attacking threat and uh, we work a lot on them uh, being up and down the pitch, but uh, sometimes we just have to yeah, let them go a little bit more. And uh, I felt like we'd done that in the second half. Uh, we, we had enough covering behind for the counter attack. And, uh, and, and also when you get into those areas, you have to be uh, clinical and put the good crosses in, put the finishing touches onto, onto the balls. And, uh, and that's what we've done. And, and we need more of that going forward because uh, this is such a tough league. You know, games can be won or lost in, in fine, uh, fine details. And uh, thankfully, we've got that right in the second half. Harry, just one last question with us. And we appreciate your time. Everything that happened in the World Cup was not that long ago. But it seems, Harry, that you have just seamlessly readapted to life in the Premier League mentally. From a mental perspective, has it been as easy as it's looked to us for you? No, of course it was a it was a tough moment for for me personally and and the team and um, but that's part and parcel of football, you know. It's uh, for me, I just wanted to get back to to doing what I love and being out there on the pitch. And uh, if anything, it just made me want to work harder and and be more de uh, determined to be uh, more successful. So uh, of course it's it's been difficult, but uh, that's why we play the game. So I'm looking forward to the rest of the season now and. Uh, this game can hopefully help us uh, finish this month strong and then uh, the rest of the, the league season as well. Congrats again, Harry Kane. Thank you so much for joining us for our Premier League coverage on NBC. Hi there, I'm Rebecca Lowe, studio host for NBC's coverage of the Premier League. Don't forget to hit subscribe to watch more videos all season long. For even more Premier League content from original series to live matches, head over to Peacock and be sure to tune in for Premier League mornings every weekend on USA Network and on Peacock. We will see you over there.